what can you do today to pay less taxes in the future? Well, let's look at this married filing jointly tax brackets for 2020. Currently, we're paying 10, 12, 22, 24, 32, 35, and 37 percent tax brackets. In 2026, right now, taxes are expected to go higher, up to 15, 25, 28, 33, 39.6. And we all know we just got a big stimulus package, but we also know we have to probably pay for that in taxes in the future. So taxes are going to probably be much higher in the next 10 years. We're currently at the lowest taxes in U.S. history. So what you might do today is maybe do a Roth conversion. Say hypothetically you were making $50,000 of taxable income and you were in that 12% tax bracket. You could convert $30,000 from an IRA, move that into a Roth IRA, and when the market recovers, all that growth on that Roth IRA is 100% tax free. You pay 12% tax on $30,000 at the lowest rates in US history, and all that growth in the Roth is tax free forever. Now, what if you mess up and you do $30,000 conversion and you go $1 over that tax bracket. So you go, say you have $80,251 of taxable income and you jump from the 12 to the 22% tax bracket. Is that a big change or a small change on your taxes? Don't worry, it's actually a small change. You're only paying 22% on that $1. I recommend if you haven't thought about Roth conversions or your financial advisor doesn't give you tax advice, then please give me a call to see if I can be of any assistance.